Tuesday, Tuesday. It's going to be the most Mondayest, Mondayest Tuesday ever. I had trouble with getting up this morning. Wanted to sleep in. Um, I set an alarm for 8.30. And then I reset it for 9 because... I knew I was not going to be getting up Give wearing my cozy today, my comfy, excuse me. Um, I made a mistake on Friday when I was getting my, uh, well, I made a mistake, period. So Angie's List. I ordered a guy from Asia. <laughs> that sounds weird, but I made a, a an appointment set up to get um, the dryer vent installed in my house. And the guy comes over on Friday, comes over early, and we decide this is the mistake I made. Instead of being paid through Angie's list. I would pay him directly. Now, originally, this seemed like a good idea because he said he would charge me less than Angie's List. So after assessing whatever he needed, he went over to, I don't know, Home Depot or somewhere, picked up the, um, the stuff that he needed to make the hole and to put the little vent in. Well... He charged me for, he ends up charging me for the thing that makes the hole. Um, which, in the end, would still have been less than what Angie's List was charging me. But not by much. So, then... <clears throat> Then, he's like, before he tells me, before all this, he could have told me that um, he's going to need cash or check. I don't carry cash or check with me. So, you're going to need to be paid by Venmo, Cash App, Hi Kitty. Look, you have food, okay? Venmo, Cash App, PayPal, Facebook, you know. And then he tells, so after he's done his work, after he's done his work, um, it's like, okay, then he tells me about needing cash or check. Uh, and then I'm like, okay, no, I can't do either one. He's like, well, I do have these apps, but my bank account's not set up. This is where it starts to sound very fishy. Very fishy. I'm like, mm, okay. Okay. Well, I don't have cash or check. And he's like, all right, well. Uh, so I'm trying to do through Venmo, but um, for some reason it's like not, or not Venmo, Cash App. I don't have any money in Cash App. I have money in Venmo. But he didn't have his Venmo account set up. Wasn't right or something. <sighs> Where are you? Um, so anyways, he doesn't have his apps set up right or something with his bank account. So what he has me do is pay through Facebook, which I'm totally fine with. I trust Facebook pay. Um, he has me pay through Facebook to his girlfriend. So I'm like, all right, I got to get this man paid. So I, for some reason... <clears throat> had the number six stuck in my head. 
600. So originally, Angie's list, hold on. Originally, Angie's list tells me $361 and change for this service. He wasn't going to charge me more than that. He was going to charge me less. Um, so I thought I had made a, big, a good idea, a good deal with him to pay him by himself and not through Angie's list. Then he goes out and gets the parts and charges me for parts. He was going to charge me $350. Now he's charging me. He was going to charge me three fifty because he didn't like odd numbers. Okay. Anyways, now he's charging me $370. So I would ended up paying more than Angie's list. By like $9 or something, but it doesn't matter, I guess. $9, I would have been fine paying the $9. Here's the thing, though. Like I was saying, I had the number six stuck in my head. So I'm thinking $670, not $370. Now, mind you, I do recall him saying th it's $300, but I only recall him saying, trying to correct me once. He didn't try real hard to correct me. Um... So I ended up paying him $670. This is 300 more. 300. 300. Now if it were like $3 where I wouldn't care or something like that, but it is $300 more. So yesterday I realized the mistake. I was busy, okay, so when Friday hit, I'm like, okay, I got this done. I was excited Monday, or Saturday, Friday, Saturday, Sunday, I was busy with the new year and stuff. Monday come around, we're still not doing anything, I'm not thinking about it until <clears throat> we get home. And then I'm like, wait a minute, I paid 600 whatever dollars, 670 Angie's list was going to charge me Three hundred, I thought. So I looked at the picture, the Angie's List price. Yep, three hundred sixty-one dollars and some change. So I mess. I sent a text to David, whatever his name is. Um, David, and I'm like, I realized a mistake today. And I need that $300. I, need it. I overpaid you $300. I also messaged the girlfriend that he had me pay through Facebook Pay. Said he, uh, I overcharged, I paid him $300 by mistake. $300 extra by mistake. So he said, he texts me. He does end up texting me. He's like, yeah, I tried. I thought you just thought I did that good of a job. $300 is not a tip, my bot, my guy. Nobody gets a $300 tip. You overcharged me. You undercharged me. And then you're saying, oh, because of gas and you had to buy the appliance and whatever. Now you're overcharging me. And you didn't try that hard to get me to pay you the right amount. You could have said, no, 300 300 Like multiple times. You said it maybe twice. Maybe. My brain sometimes doesn't get it the first time, all right? Sorry, it just doesn't work that way. Stroke, victim, all that kind of stuff. Anyway, yo, I overpaid you $300. So he has said in his message that he would pay me back. In his text message. I am keeping this text message until I get that $300 back. He says he's going to pay that $300 back to his girlfriend because he's still on his bank account or whatever set up, right? So that the girlfriend can then pay me the three hundred dollars back. <clears throat> so that was the mistake I made. I should have just gone through Angie's and had them pay me and not gone 
through him individually. That was my mistake. Lesson learned. But hopefully it's not a $300 lesson. We'll see. Did the hen run away? Because it was chicken. <coughs> Good evening. Welcome to here. I don't know if I'm going to make anything. Probably not. Uh, maybe. Let's see. Do we have anything for tacos? We don't have any shells. I'll just cut up this summer sausage. Just eat some summer sausage. That sounds good. I have summer sausage. And of course, Miss Purdy comes over here. Because she's begging. What? If you turn around... I tried to brush her today. I know. You want to smell this bag? No, but I'm sure she wants what's in the bag. All right. Um, Hereditary is on Prime, supposedly. I'm going to see if I can watch it. So, Hereditary is not available for free on Prime, but Black Phone is. And Black Phone, I wanted to see in the theater. So, I can watch it tonight, and then I'm going to go to bed after this. But, you'll get my, re my little bit of a reaction after it's done. My dishwasher is full of cups. We have so many cups, we've got enough for a, coupe, a cup du jour. What does du jour mean? Cup du jour is the day, cup of the day. You know, like a soup du jour is a soup of the day. This cup du jour. You know, I'm probably wrong. Let's find out. Alexa, what is of the day? Alexa, how do you say of the day in French? Of the day in French is du jour. Du jour. So, cup du jour cup of the day so we have enough cups for the cup of the day seriously it's enough cups 365 cups we don't need 365 cups too many goddamn cups all right well on that note i'm gonna go to bed tomorrow's wednesday yeah wednesday so have yourself a great night and I'll see you tomorrow. Toodles.